Hey, what's up guys? This is Federico and today I'm here with my friend Giovanni. We will try to set up a remote mixing session, meaning that Giovanni is going to share his screen and the audio stream coming out of his door with me. And I will be able to control his computer remotely from my studio, so I will be able to edit and mix things within his session without the need to transfer files. And it's very simple, it only uses two pieces of software. The first one is called AnyDesk and it's the one we use to share the screen. And the other one is called Audio Movers Listen To and we use that to share the audio stream coming out of Giovanni's DAW. AnyDesk is free for personal use and if you're a professional it's like nine bucks a month for a single user and then there's other options for multiple devices. And Audio Movers has a seven day free trial period and after that it's like uh, uh, 10 bucks a month. So you can basically try this out for free and if you like it and if it's the right thing for you and if you work with this kind of stuff, the price is quite affordable. I also wanted to point out that this method works with both Mac and PC and it works with any DAW because you just basically uh, load the Audio Movers plugin on your mix bus. Now we'll go through the setup process. Okay, Giovanni, you ready? Yeah. Uh, this is AnyDesk, the uh, software we use to share the screen. So Giovanni has to give me his uh, um, address code. Uh, Giovanni, can you text the code to me? Yes. Okay, so let's connect. Okay, so this is Giovanni's uh, Cubase session. As you can see, the video quality uh, is very nice and I should be able to control everything. Okay, uh, the shortcuts work, uh, everything works, it's pretty cool. Now let's give uh, Audio Movers a try. So now I have to load the Audio Mover plugin in, in my insert slot of my master bus. Um, in that way, Federico can listen what my actual output is and you will have to log in with your username and password. Right now I have mine uh, or already typed in, so I click login. I am logged in. If the person who is using uh, the Listen To plugin uh, doesn't really know what to do, uh, since I'm controlling his session, I can also uh, load his plugin for him. So that's uh, very easy to set up. Another cool thing with the um, Listen To plugin is that you can set up the uh, streaming quality. So for example, I can stream with full 24-bit uh, wave quality, which is actually pretty cool. And of course, in order to do this, uh, you have to have a very good connection. Uh, luckily, me and Giovanni both have a good connection, so uh, this will work just fine. So right now, uh, everything is uh, correctly set up. We can start the transmission. I'm gonna copy the link and paste it into my browser. And here's what I see. So I'll click on Start Listening. Everything seems to be fine. Let's see if this actually works. Okay, so now I will try to EQ his guitars. Let's remind that any processing we want to do has to be done before the Listen To plugin. So let's load uh, ProQ2. So this was just a test, but of course you can do the same for a full mixing session if your connection allows it. And there's a tiny bit of latency, so you have to be patient, but you know, this can work. Giovanni, what do you think about it? Uh, I just think that this way you can actually uh, steal some good presets from people, so no, I'm joking, no. You loaded an empty session here, so I can't really steal your stuff. I did it on purpose because I, I knew that you were trying. No, I'm joking. No, I think it's a really powerful tool and I think a lot of people can will actually benefit from it. So yeah. That's it guys. I think this is so cool and I will try this out with some clients of mine, uh, maybe doing some remote production, recording and mixing sessions. And this also makes it super easy uh, to do remote mixing lessons if that's your thing. So either way, just keep being productive, keep making music with your friends, even if you're stuck at home for a few days. I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, please leave a comment and subscribe and I will see you guys next time.